Okay, nice. So what made you get interested in running for the member of parliament seat in Dar es Salaam? Uh, my vision and dream to serve the people of Dar es Salaam comes from uh, my background, where I'm coming from. I have uh, voted, at least I've voted four times in Dar es Salaam. And before that, people had voted before me. Uh, growing up in Moya, the same, same challenges we faced when I was growing up are the same, same challenges that we have today in the very south. If you look at uh, issues of uh, water, when I was a little girl, Tulichota Maji, Kwa Muto, and uh, some wells, long distances. Nimechota maji na kwa mugongo, nimechota maji na baiskeri, nimechota maji na ngombe, ikasia. And up until today, there are people, our girls, our women are still doing the same. And remember I've told you, at least I've, I've, I've voted four times. There are people who have voted more times than I. But the same, same problems that we've had are the same ones that we have today. Uh, the issue of roads. When I, when I was blessed enough to buy my first car, I could not access my home. And what I did was mobilize a few youths here and there, and we tried to fix our road. Thereafter, I was able, of course, to <coughs> keep fixing it over and over. Yeah? But you can imagine I was able to fix the road heading to my home. So every other road is impossible, apart from those that are lucky enough to have someone who can be able to fix their roads for themselves. Why is it that way? Well, if you look at uh, our surrounding, uh, our neighboring constituencies, they have roads heading even to nowhere. Tarmac, live around the rural roads. Barabara zin ata akuna mahali zinaenda, lakini zimetengenezwa. Sisi hatuna. If you look at the last 20 years, we don't even have a single government, national government project within Bere South. We don't have. Right? Even a single kilometer of tarmac, apart from what Honabo Mutava tried, but it, was, it never came to be. Why? You go to Bere South, Bere North, they are tarmac. The stomach road everywhere. You go to where our neighboring, they actually doing roads coming through. Did you go to join the table? All right. Ah, you go to Muranga, Kingilia Kwasamaki, which is just neighboring us. The stomach everywhere, but we have nothing. We've been left like an island. And I, I sat and asked myself, honestly speaking, we are voting. We wake up every five years to go and vote. Why is it that these leaders that we vote for do not think about the challenges that make us vote for them? Why? Is it uh, every time they get in, they forget about us? Wana to sahao tu, ama they just take us for granted, ama wajui mashida zetu. Si nikaona, apa, wata to deal na shida zetu sisi wenyewe. And that is why I decided this time round, I would want to serve our people. I have tried serving them at my personal capacity, but that can only do so much. So, with a with that, with that title, at least my other gonga gonga mlango, ni fumbuliwe, na ni seme shida za watu wa mbele south, kitakua ni kienda kukoleka shida za angu, ni shida za watu wa mbele south. Because when you are lokua, sijui ni nini ime happen, kwa sababu, we cannot be an island of development. Like, development happens and we are left out there.